Hello everyone. Today let's solve an algorithm problem. Add two numbers. Let's see the problem. Hello everyone. Today let's see a new algorithm problem. Add two numbers. Let's see the problem first. You are given two non-empty linked lists representing two non-negative integers. The digits are stored in reverse order, and each of their nodes contains a single digit. Add the two numbers and return it as a linked list. You may assume the two numbers do not contain any leading zero, except the number zero itself. Example, the input the first linked list is 2, 4, 3, and the second linked list is 5, 6, 4. Adding two linked lists together, the output should be 7, 0, 8. The explanation is the first linked list represents 342 and the second linked represent 465, so the result is 807. You can pause the video and think about this problem. First, let's see how to solve such a problem. Uh, I need to tell you about uh, the techniques Today we will use divide and conquer technique. The idea is for large problem, we split this big problem into several sub-problems, and then we conquer those sub-problems. After that, we merge those results together, and that will be the problem's answer. One usual case for such divide and conquer is recursion. Recursion means that for big problem, the sub-problem is the similar or, or the, almost the same as the big problem. So we can see it's this problem repeat again and again, but the scope is get smaller and smaller just like the picture in the right side. For divide and conquer techniques, there are three phases. The first is split. For big problem, split into sub-problems. And the second phrase is solve sub-problem recursively. And the third stage is to merge them together. Now let's analyze the problem of the day. For two linked lists, we will uh, add them uh, for the lowest digit. The first uh, linked list is 2, the second linked list is 5. S so if we want to get the result, we just add them together and we can get 7. Of course, for this example, we also see that a case that uh, it may have carry. Like uh, the second digit, 4 plus 6 equals 10. So the sum put into the result digit is 0, and uh, it will also generate a carry, uh, and it will should put into the next uh, digit. However, if we uh, consider the uh, carry, this problem is uh, repeated we can calculate the lower digits and uh, the other parts is almost the same as this big problem. This means we can use divide and conquer to solve this problem. 
Now let's see our first solution. We use divide and conquer and that recursion scale to solve this problem. From this algorithm, you can see that it uses the solution one method called the solution one method in this uh, function. So this is the recursion. It means that a large problem is composed by a small part of the problem. So other parts of the algorithm is just to solve the digits of current level. Let's see another solution. For all the recursion, we can always break that recursion and uh, here we use iteration to solve that problem. Inside this algorithm, we use while to iterate all the digits of the linked lists. That's the two solutions for today's question. For the recursion, it's just like these cartoon pictures. It's uh, only a small part of the picture, but it's the same as the larger one. I hope you all enjoy today's video. Thank you.